feeds it out. Wide open look. Harris again, and he hits it. Three three pointers in three trips. The freshman is red hot from outside. Sadinsky's going the other way. He feeds to Harris. He fires up a three, and he knocks down another. Oh, Virginia rolling now, and these fans are pumped in Charlottesville. Harris fires from three. Joe Harris grew up in the small town of Chelan in central Washington. A coach's son, Harris garnered the attention of then Washington State head coach Tony Bennett. When I went to watch him, the open gym, it was him and his two sisters playing and they, whoever else they could round up in this little tiny gym in Chelan, Washington. And uh, I still remember that like it was yesterday. And there's something this kid to be as good as he is in this environment, that's terrific. Coach Bennett, regardless of the size of the school that I played in and all the doubts that people kind of had about me coming out of high school. He always really believed in me and he even believed that I could play at this level in the ACC when not a lot of people did. It was definitely a tough decision. I didn't ever really see myself coming out on the East Coast at all. I come from a very small town, a very large family. And then Coach Bennett pulled a fast one on me. And I thought, you know, we, we got a chance at him. I thought, boy, I don't know if he would venture all the way across. But I knew, obviously, in taking this job, how special it was here in terms of academics, facilities, the league, all those things. I thought, if I can just get him here, then maybe I can talk him into at least strongly considering it. I mean, I came out here, and my parents and myself, everybody kind of entrusted him that, you know, he would be like, my family away from my family at home because I'm not going to have the opportunity to see them a lot and he's done just that since I've been here. Bennett presented a vision to Joe on where the program could go. Harris saw the turnaround at Washington State and he relished the opportunity to do the same thing at Virginia. And I really wanted to just be a part of something like that where you know I could say, look back and say I was part of the foundation that changed Virginia basketball back around and got it back to where it once was. I knew we had a real good one. Though he didn't have five stars or four stars behind his name, that means nothing. It, it means how they develop, but I just knew he was a diamond in the rough, and that's really what he was. With Harris at UVA, the town of Chelan adopted the Cavaliers as their own. You see uh, a number of community members with Virginia uh, jerseys and, and shirts and, and paraphernalia on. It's also a strong character to believe in Virginia basketball because of what Joe's done and then what and what he's brought back from Virginia about what the program is all about. You know, not only are they fans of me, but they're just fans of uh, you know Virginia in general now. And I think uh, I wouldn't be surprised if even next year after I graduate, people are still watching Virginia games on the court. Harris's game evolved from a predominant three-point shooter to a complete guard. He really has improved. And again, he was complete in high school, but he came here, like he said, a little more just a shooter, developed the rebounding, developed his ability to put it on the floor to pull up, and uh, his defense has improved a lot. It's nice to see that. That's gratifying for our coaching staff. A basketball coach himself, Harris's father has also noticed the growth in his son's game. On the court, his game has just taken off. Offensively, he's, he's so much better off the dribble than what he was when he left our program. He defends at the highest level. I mean, he can guard anybody. And uh, he's, he's got that competitive desire to always be better. And I think those are things that he ju he's just expanded on even more so here uh, since he's been at Virginia. And the vision Bennett talked about with Harris about the future of Virginia basketball partly came true during Joe's final home game where in front of fans, friends, and family, Harris helped the Cavaliers defeat fourth-ranked Syracuse and clinch the ACC regular season title. And he sent a text and he said, this is one of the greatest weekends of my life. He said, that was incredible. And though Joe didn't score 30 points, he's even scored less this year. He won a conference championship and shared it with his family from Chelan. A bunch of them came with this community who have watched him really grow up and he shared it with our family our basketball family and just to know the kind of person he is that was a great story and that was the culmination of it for me he loves this place and it's a big part of his being and I'm hoping that the people here in Virginia feel the same way about Joe that he feels about them. I'm unbelievably thankful and just grateful that uh, Coach Bennett and the rest of the staff gave me an opportunity to come uh, get my education here 
and go to such a special place because the memories and everything that I've had and made here and the friendships, all the connections, they're going to carry on with me for the rest of my life and I'm just so, so thankful for it.